Is chrononutrition beneficial for menopausal women? Let's find out. Chrononutrition means eating by your body's natural circadian rhythms, consuming certain nutrients at certain times of the day in order to have the best biochemical function is the goal of chrononutrition. In menopause, that's particularly important because your hypothalamus controls your circadian rhythm and it gets disrupted by the menopausal decline of hormones, so your circadian rhythm becomes disrupted. Your hypothalamus controls your biological clock through the suprachiasmic nucleus. The suprachiasmic nucleus is entrained by the light and dark information that comes through your eyes via the retinal hypothalamic tract. Your hypothalamus organizes the chronological pathways or clocks that run your body. Because your hypothalamus is not protected by the blood-brain barrier, it is super sensitive to your nutritional intake. You also have peripheral organs like your liver, kidneys, and skeletal muscle that act like clocks. These peripheral clocks are entrained by your behaviors like eating, exercising, and how you respond to stress. Macronutrients, protein, carbohydrates, and fats are important regulators of the circadian clock in your peripheral tissues. By controlling the timing of particular food intake, you can help normalize your circadian rhythm. Now, can chrononutrition benefit menopausal women? Yes, chrononutrition can actually aid in recovery and rejuvenate tissues. In fact, an interesting study on menopausal women in their 60s found that chrononutrition positively affected their muscle mass and their strength. The researcher measured women's muscle strength and mass before and after treatment, then split the group in half. Both groups of women were eating their ideal amount of protein to maintain their lean body mass, but the experimental group was asked to eat the majority of their protein early in the day. In fact, they consumed 80 to 90% of their protein before the early afternoon. What happened is the women who followed chrononutrition principles and consumed protein early in the day had increased their lean body mass and muscle strength, and that is super important for menopausal women. When your lean body mass increases, your metabolism increases and helps you stay stronger, more vital, and healthier. Plus, you're less likely to put on that extra body fat. How much protein you need daily to maintain your lean body mass is half to three quarter gram per pound of your lean body mass. If you have 100 pounds of lean body mass, that means you need at least 50 to 75 grams of protein per day. So following chrononutritional principles, you would have to consume at least 40 to 60 grams of protein before three o'clock in the afternoon. Now it's really important that you eat the right foods at the right time. It's common knowledge that when we eat a heavy meal, like at Thanksgiving time, you feel sleepy, partly due to tryptophan rich turkey, but mostly to heavy carbohydrate side dishes. Eating melatonin stimulating foods like tart cherries, goji berries, and almonds at night can help you sleep. And paying attention to what you eat when is the basis of chrononutrition. I've counseled my patients for at least two decades to eat less calories after dusk than the rest of the day in order to have a higher base of metabolic rate and store less body fat. Your natural fast should be at night consuming the majority of your calories, especially protein, early in the day, particularly if you're menopausal. Now, if you have any questions whatsoever about chrononutrition and menopause, please join me in my hormone support group. You get free access through our hormone reboot training. I have found that my patients who support their hypothalamus, which controls your circadian rhythm with Genesis Gold, have a tendency to crave what their body needs. They tend to crave more protein during the day and crave tryptophan foods at night. They crave the nutrients they need, not just for their circadian clock, but also for their seasonal clock, like craving more beta-carotene rich orange vegetables in the fall, which can help them ward off seasonal affective disorder. I'll see you in the next video.